Have you ever felt overwhelmed with the idea of building wealth? I know it can seem like an insurmountable task at times, kind of like if you had to lift two million pounds, not something you could do all at once. But here's a little secret. It's all about taking small, consistent steps. Do you remember this? A few months ago, I told you that during my workouts, I got this huge accolade, and it said that I lifted two million pounds. And obviously, sounds kind of impressive, right? But if you recall that video, I didn't do it all in one day. I didn't even do it in a week or even a month. I did it gradually over time. See, I have this fitness uh, workout system called tonal it's kind of a smart home gym that mounts on the wall provides these personalized workouts and it tracks every lift every rep every pound well today or that day i had the cumulative lifts that hit two million pounds now i tend to average around 10 to 12 thousand pounds per workout which means it took roughly 166 workouts to reach that milestone. And building your wealth is remarkably similar. It's not about making a million dollars overnight, that'd be nice. It's about consistently applying key principles over time. And I call these principles the four keys to building wealth. And they are time, compounding, leverage, and tax advantages. So let's just break them down real quick. And by the way, you can read all about this in my book called the four keys to building wealth. So let's first talk about time. Time is really your best friend when it comes to wealth building. And the earlier you can start in your life, the more time you have, the more your money can grow. So don't wait. You never get back yesterday or last week. You need to start now and be consistent. Now the next thing is compounding. Compounding is the process of your money growing and it literally grows exponentially over time. Think about it as your money-making machine, if you will. Think of it as your money-making money, then that money-making money, then that money-making money, and so on. The more compounding periods you have, the more wealth you're gonna have. The next one is leverage. Now leverage means using borrowed money to increase your potential return on an investment. For example, most people buy a home using leverage. It's called a mortgage. When you're leveraging your down payment, what happens is you still get the full benefit of your home's appreciation, even though you might have only put a small amount of money down. But remember, leverage can amplify losses as well as gains, so you need to use it wisely. And the fourth key is tax advantages. Taxes can eat away at your wealth so quickly and utilizing tax advantaged accounts and strategies that help keep more money in your pocket and working for you can help accelerate your wealth. But just like lifting 2 million pounds, building wealth is about consistency. It's about making smart financial decisions day after day, year after year. And it's about setting those goals and making a plan and then just basically sticking to it. Imagine if I challenged you to read 25 pages today in a book you'd probably think, forget it, that's impossible. But if you read just 10 pages a day, you could easily finish 2,500 pages in a year. Same principle applies to wealth. Small, consistent actions add up over time. The best part, you are the ultimate income producing machine. So by leveraging your time, your skills, and your resources, you can create multiple streams of income. And as your wealth grows, it can start working for you and generating even more income. Remember, the only way to retire is to somehow, some way, and someday replace your income. So start today. Let the power of time and compounding work for you. Leverage your assets wisely and take advantage of every tax benefit that you can. Remember, building wealth isn't necessarily a sprint. It's a journey. It's a step-by-step -step journey every single day. Well, if you found any of this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. Stay tuned for more tips on leveraging life and building your financial future. Until next time, take care.